his opponent's body. Round two is upon us. Your thoughts on round one, champ? Round one was a very close round. Fight. Both guys had their moments, but nobody has really went out ahead in the race as we go into the second round. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Ooh, what a punch. Way to hide that leg kick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Well, we know knees to be some of the most destructive strikes in MMA, and he's got that part of his game going tonight. He has got the knees going. He's throwing them in bunches. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Nice body kick. Oh! Oh! Boom! Big jab. And that one cut him open. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Beautiful body kick. What a punch. Just over three minutes to go. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Oh! Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. Oh! Yet another big knee. Moving to half guard, shades of Daniel Cormier slicing through that guard. Unbelievable. I love it. Like a knife through butter. What a great job, Pass. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. And now he falls back into the finishing position. to watch. All right, right into side control here, DC. Biggest difference between half guard and side control. Well, side control to me feels like a little bit less control because now my legs aren't really doing anything anymore. Now I'm controlling you with my upper body. So I've got to be very, very aware. It's still advantageous, but it just seems a little more free-flowing than having something like a half guard. Looks like he's going for an arm bar here. How tight is that? Attacking arm bar. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round. Saved by the bell. So back to the stool. Mentally probably not in a great place here. We'll see if he can recover and get himself back into this fight. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's your replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. All right, so another round is now underway. Pretty good action over the previous 10 minutes. Your thoughts on what we might see here? Both of the guys really picking up on the action, putting their foot on the gas, and really starting to drive it home as we approach the end of the fight. And we're still so evenly matched, and the fight has been so cool. Oh, what a shot to the body. He's told us in that region. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. It does not get much better than that.